The National Science Foundation ordered a UTRGV assistant professor more than half a million dollars to study parrot babble. Let me explain. A lot of animals vocalize, but only a few learn to vocalize from a tutor. Usually a parent, uh, uh, listening to it, processing what the parent is uh, vocalizing inside their head, and then trying to imitate it, and then attenuating that imitation until they get it just right. Parrots are one type of animal that does this. You're probably familiar with another. A really good example of an animal that learns their vocalizations are actually human beings. It's mine. <laughs> the complexity of, of the, the acoustic structure of the vocal babbling signals apparently um, can give you insights into, into cognitive development and how the, how the child is going to do later on in, in life sometimes. Which brings us back to the parrots, an animal model used to study vocal babbling. UTRGV assistant professor Dr. Carl Berg is a researcher in the longest ongoing study of any wild parrot population in the world, which is in Venezuela. He noticed that green rump parrotlets in the nest were vocalizing, even though there was no parent in the nest. I got really excited when I, when I saw that because um, it was kind of late in development, um, like vocal babbling, you know, again, babies don't do this right out of the womb. Uh, they kind of cry and do, do some uh, much simpler things. With parrotlets vocalizing to each other, it was an opportunity to see how siblings affect cognitive development. We can ask, well, does, does you know, growing up with one or two siblings sort of change how you manifest this behavior later in development, um, as opposed to growing up with you know, 11 brothers and sisters? Researchers recorded the parrots in Venezuela for hundreds of hours. Graduate student Kayla Bariano reviews the recordings to study how the individuals interact. I'm uh, looking at the social environmental influences of sibling uh, social interactions and seeing whether or not um, these uh, interactions influence the development of vocally learned behaviors. We jumped at the opportunity to look at this in a, in a natural population. You can learn about more research underway at the UTRGV Biology Department by visiting utrgv.edu biology.